Traffic on I-94 is moving again following a crash earlier this morning. This is a look at video from Safety Vid. You could see the Flight for Life helicopter landing on I-94 near Brookfield. Rebecca Clough is live near where it all happened in Waukesha County. And Rebecca, you have been speaking with those people impacted by this crash all morning. What did they say? Yeah, Simone, I've been uh, talking to quite a few drivers who have been looking at a different scene this morning until just a few minutes ago. There, there was backup all behind me. Now, as you can see, it is freely moving and uh, people were worried and concerned about what was happening on I-94 this morning. This was the scene just a few hours ago around 8 this morning. The Waukesha County Sheriff responded to what they say was a crash on I-94 with just one vehicle and someone was thrown from it. The deputies say a 44 year old man somehow dro drove off the highway and ended in a ditch. The highway was shut down in both directions for flight for life to land and transport that man to the hospital. People in the area say they were starting their morning commute when they realized there was nowhere to go. The traffic was uh, coming to a stop right there and then that squad car over here where the on ramp is, that's where the squad car stop the traffic from coming in. So Mike is doing what a lot of people did this morning. He just avoided the highway altogether. Now the sheriff said the man is seriously hurt and they are still investigating what caused that accident to happen. Reporting in Brookfield, Rebecca Clough, TMJ4 News. Yeah, hopefully that man pulls through and get to see the interstate back open. Thank you, Rebecca.